Hey guys, it's me, your Fuji from Nepal, and welcome to my food channel, Fuji from Nepal, presented by Stanty Hub. Well, guys, you guys have seen in my previous episode that I usually visit and review fancy restaurant, but today I thought, why not to visit local restaurant? And that's what I'm doing it today because today I'm here at one of the very famous local restaurant of K Town, and I'll be taking you guys there. So when it comes to Choi Lam, we are familiar with this dish because one of the famous Newari cuisine. But wait, have you guys heard about Matsako Soila or tried Matsako Soila? If not, then don't miss out to watch this episode till the end because I'm taking you guys today at Matsako Soila Girl. So fam, without any further ado, let's get in! So guys, finally I can see here varieties of soila on my table. Here are three prakar ko soila sa, and which I'm gonna try this. And the first time, se moi matcha ko soila try ko desu. And matcha ko soila is also one of the special of this place. The use is a sukuti ko soila, and the same way I also do have the normal soila that we eat in daily basis. So without any further ado, I'm gonna start with the matcha ko soila. Guys, this is what I call a heaven. Now I get to know that why my food bloggers friend have recommending me this place for special matcha ko soila. It's so delectable, and every masalas are so well mixed with this soila. Literally, tapa liyo town se visit gaur nahi possible for this delectable matcha ko soila. And to go with soila, I'm Nepali Kuchura. As earlier, my little boy, I'm so good. Three prakar ko soila as I'm saying so. So now I'm gonna try sukuti soila. Though it's not a new dish for me because I've already tried it before. But still, yeah, so let me see how it tastes. Hmm. Hmm. Sukuti ko say usually what happens is it gives me hard texture. So that is yeah, so the texture of sukuti is so balanced. But as earlier I said, masalas are extremely well mixed, Paco sir. So I'm absolutely loving this one as well. So fam, the very final dish of the day we do have boff soila. So boff soila, I say we all are familiar about this because most of the Newari communities are because say boff soila is the main cuisine. So I'm really excited to have yanko soila because yanko gravy is more like the main appealing logi ra ko sir. I'm literally drooling to have this right now. So I'm going to take a first bite. Wow! Surprisingly, Nyako Tinte Sola is so good, and I must have to be very thankful to my food bloggers friend once more for recommending me this place because I'm I'm literally getting to try this all delectable soila. Guys, you all can see my tummy, which is already full with this delectable soila of matcha ko soila gar. I am absolutely loving the place. Ranya ko khana ko the kurei na garo, and I definitely agree that some of the local restaurants of K Town have amazing taste because they give an authentic taste, which is really great and which we can't find with some of the fancy restaurants. I am definitely recommending every one of you people to visit here at matcha ko soila gar, which is located at Hari Gaon, and also to all my Newari friends. I won't be telling you guys to invite me for a soila party anymore, because whenever I crave for soila, I'm definitely coming to Matsa Ko Soila Gar. So ending up today's episode, keep showering your love. Do like, subscribe, and share our channel, Food Blog, Foodie from Nepal, presented by Stanty Hub. And yes, get connected with us through our social media, which the description is below down. To check us out and to follow us on Instagram and Facebook. With that note, signing off for today. Keep showering your love. As always, you guys have showered love to Fury from Nepal. 
Much love from Foodie from Nepal. Bye bye.